Hey folks, it's Kesmir, and I'm back with Firewatch. We just, I guess we looted Brian Goodwin's little hideout here. And oh, we got the anchors too. So I think we're good to go here. Had a bunch of neat little stuff. I don't know, he's kind of a geeky kid. Maybe he doesn't like going outdoors. Oh, here we go. Ah, so yeah, that's why we need these. Sweet. What do you think is in there? There's got to be something. Why else try to kill me? I don't know, really. I mean, we gotta find out. What do you think? Whatever it is, they don't want you telling anyone about. I mean, they closed the door when they could have just... Bashed your head in with a rock or chopped you up with a... Are you oh, serious yeah, with this thanks. shit right now? Thanks. A, a hatchet. God, are you sure you want to go back in there? Honestly, I just... I just want to know. I want to know what is worth doing everything that's been done to us. Me too. And not going to jail would be a nice kicker. Look, just tell the truth. Am I even going the right way? Where are we at? Guess I gotta go back to the entrance of the cave? Where am I? Okay. Yeah, there's the cave. Okay, we just head south here. And I, am I heading south? Yeah. Okay, so this way. Oh, uh, also, those girls turned up. Looks like you didn't kill him. Nobody did. Oh, good. I took some farmer's tractor for a joyride down in Riverton and uh, landed in jail. Yeah, I wonder if they know anything. If there's some way to ask them about whatever happened at their camp. I think we'd be smart to let sleeping dogs lie. <sighs> You're probably right. Oh, was, I don't know. I don't know, Delilah. Whatever you say, girl. That, that means it was the guy with the flashlight. The girls have nothing to do with all this. That's the cave. <laughs> so much fun going in here. Is your killer man? Hello. Don't kill me. I'm sure, he'll get the door. Oh no, I just Oh no. I just realized there is there is a shoe last time I was in here. And then she was saying, if you remember a few episodes back, she was saying that she, they just disappeared. Is Brian down here? Goodness, I hope not. But why would there be a shoe down here? Hopefully he just like slipped or something and the shoe fell off. I don't want to come down here. I really don't want to come down here. Yeah. I don't like it. Do you guys like it? I don't like it. Oh. 
Oh gosh. Oh no. Oh shit. Oh, are you serious? Are you... Oh god. Oh, uh, it was his shoe. You fell. Your stuff gave out. I don't like this. Ew. I don't even like that I took a picture of that. You're Brian Goodwin. Oh no. God. Uh. <sighs> yeah, that's quite a fall. I don't know. Get proof that Brian's down here now. He didn't like climbing. Well, so why was he climbing? He hated climbing so much. His, uh, I bet his dad made him or something. That's what he said. He was hiding the climbing gear so his dad didn't make him climb. Me the heebie jeebies. Hey, D. There you are. I've been worrying my ass off. Hey, you, um, might want to take a seat. I've been sitting this entire time. I'm almost always sitting. What's, what's wrong? The only thing in the cave was a body. A body? Delilah, it's Brian Goodwin. <sighs> Gotta be fucking kidding me. How does that... <clears throat> what? I don't... <sighs> How? Climbing, I think, or made to look like a climbing accident. Mm-hmm. I, I think that's just what it was. I mean, he was probably exploring the cave and, and maybe his rope gave out. But whoever locked me in there probably didn't even know about him. I'm sorry, Delilah. I'm so sorry. He'd be alive if I had told someone he was out here. I don't know where he'd be, but I can assure you it would not be rotting at the bottom of that cave. Well... There's, there's, there's nothing to say. Hide back. I think we're leaving tomorrow anyway. I mean, you kind of have a track record of... Kind of not telling people things you're supposed to tell them. I'm just a saying. Pick up my belongings. We got planes flying by. Wow, look at it out there. You see that plane? No, uh, actually, no. no. I was just busy packing up. Well, there's going to be a lot more. The service says this thing is 2% contained. Well, is this the flapjack fire or the site fire or...? Well, the two fires merged into one unmitigated disaster. They're renaming it after my lookout. You about packed up? Shouldn't we talk for a sec, you know, about things? About what? 
We still don't know who was listening to us, who was following me around, who made that tape. Yeah, all we have is the body of a dead boy who did nothing wrong. But maybe we can still find these people. Look, I think whoever's out there caused the site fire to cover their tracks, and I'm almost certain that when I get off the helicopter, I'm going to be led into a room and made to listen to a tape of me saying we started it. And we don't know shit. What can I do? Well, there's something for you to do. Holy shit. Holy crap. Yeah. Uh, oh my god. We don't know what it is. It could be nothing. Yeah, it could also be whoever was listening to us. Who, whoever made the tape. Okay. Yeah, um... Look, you should pack up everything you need in case we get the call and you can't come back. Alright, look. If, if something happens... I'll remember you. I was hoping you'd have a backup plan or something. Yeah, um, okay, I'm probably gonna move to Canada. Ontario, maybe. No, I meant if something happens to me. Right, if you don't find out who made the tape and I have to hit the road. Oh, forget it. <laughs> Be safe, Henry. Okay. Um, I'm gonna end this one here. I think I have everything I want packed up. I don't see anything else. I, I, I grab Bucket Jr. Can't leave him in this mess. So... I guess I'll see you guys in the next one. Like, comment, subscribe. Kazmir out.